Okay, so I'm going to talk today about, I'm just testing the mic, I'm going to talk today about the, I think it's a topic about the, um, the X Games, including the Call of Duty Esports, which I don't think is really a good idea to do, it's just my thought, but if you guys disagree, obviously, for the comments, I don't care what you guys think, but it's just not even really a sport. Like this, like Call of Duty is not really that challenging of a game. They're going to include each. They're going to try and include it. The only reason it's in there is because of popularity and people saying it's a sport, which I personally don't see as a sport. I mean, like you can say, oh, it's a sport because of the competition. There's competition in um, science fairs too. That's not a sport. Those are just hobbies. It's a hobby. And then the X is supposed to be for extreme, because skateboarding and BMXing and all that is kind of extreme, I mean, it's dangerous and extreme. But, and then you guys just, I don't even know, it's just, I don't find Call of Duty to be that extreme, it's just a game. I think games shouldn't be really like that, it should just be for fun, not for competition and all that. If they're going to put it, try and put in a game that's competition, like they should use on that. It doesn't. You can't just play it by yourself. You have to. Where it requires you to communicate with your team all the time. You, like you can't just play without your team and do well by yourself. You have to actually communicate with everyone that's in your team, even if it's not normal people that you play with. And something like League or StarCraft and all that, like League of Legends, if you know what League was or StarCraft. If you know what StarCraft, look it up. Those games are actually quite difficult, but you have to communicate with your team to be able to do well in it. And if you don't, then it's too bad. You will end up losing big time. And if you watch any of like their tournaments for League and StarCraft, it can get pretty intense. Not like how people like freak out because the guy gets like a double kill in S and D. You have League of Legends and StarCraft are actually pretty difficult games. COD is just simple. If with League, it's like in COD anyone can kill anyone. In League, if you're like, not as good, like, if your build's not as good as the other team on that enemy team, then you're going to be screwed anyways. So you just have to make sure you do it correctly. And you have to always build properly and all that. And then you also have to make sure that, you know, you're working as a team. And seriously, just working as a team, I don't find sports requires teamwork. I understand there's teams in COD, but... It all throughout requires a team. You can't just do it by yourself. I mean, there are sure, sure there are some sports where it can be done by itself, but sports that require a team, you cannot do by yourself all the time. It just you can't happen that way. You have to be able to do stuff together and as a team. But I just don't really understand how it works like that. How oh, God is how I don't even, I don't think any gaming should be considered a sport because it's not a sport. It's just to have I think it's just a fun. I understand you can sports are to have fun too, but. Not, I, don't th I think the idea of doing a competition for Call of Duty and all of the games is just plain out stupid. I just don't like it. And it's just all about how you play the game. I don't think, I hate the whole, like, who's better than who, like, the League community, like, I hate both the Call of Duty and the League community. Because literally, like, if you're not the greatest, then everyone just calls you shit and that you're terrible at the game. Which I just hate. I think it should just be like, oh, this guy's not as good as me. Oh, well, he'll eventually get there. Maybe he's new to the game. And then you also have all the people in the Call of Duty community where it's like, if you don't trick shot, everyone calls you garbage. Like, eh, my stepbrother with a trick shot, he's pretty bad at it anyways. But, and then he just trash talking to anyone. Someone using a regular gun, like an assault rifle, or an SMG, or an LMG, or a shotgun, he calls them trash. Then someone's using a sniper and trying to do what he does, he calls them trash. Like, that's what it is. If you're not like that one person trying to do it, then you're trash. Which I hate. And then League is pretty bad. Like if you are doing pretty bad in a game, everyone calls you garbage. They report you for purposely feeding and not trying to win. And it's just terrible. It's just all a bunch of people just getting upset and all that. And which I really don't think should be those communities should be brought in. Like I understand with like sports, you get all excited for your favorite team and all that. Like I I do that myself, but. We don't. I don't call anyone else like guards because they're this on. It's just all throughout. I don't think that community should be brought onto a certain stage, like professionally, and broadcasted like around the world and just shown everywhere. Just not something I think of doing. Sorry for the flag. There we go. 
just not something that should happen. So that's my thoughts.